See it, rent it, skip it this morning with movie critic from FatGuysAtTheMovies.com, Kevin Carr. Kevin, three big movies hitting the movie theaters this weekend. Big uh, relative. All right, well, let's check out the first one. It's family friendly. Yes. Tooth Fairy, yes. starring The Rock. Dwayne Johnson. Mm -hmm. uh, is he doing kid movies now? Just well, he did the game plan a couple years ago, which was right. a Disney movie, and that was cute. So it seems to be the, that's the, the, trend. the, yeah, if you're an action star, then they throw you in a kid's movie. <laughs> uh, he needs, I think he needs to do some more action because you don't want to get stuck in that. You know, our Schwarzenegger right. was able to do them all. But this one is sort of, I call this the Santa Claus 4 because it, <laughs> okay. it's very similar to that. It's in fact directed by the guy who did the Santa Claus 2 and 3, where he's a hockey player who's known for knocking people's teeth out, and then he sort <laughs> Sort of crushes a kid's dreams and his pen his his sentence is to be a tooth fairy fairy for it's two It's kind weeks. of he is kind of adorable though with those little wings there. Well, you know his his best comedy comes from just sort of being uh, you know making himself look silly and that's right. sort of the face to face comedy and this doesn't quite work with him. If he doesn't pull it off. No, he doesn't. But he's up against people like Billy Crystal, who's right. who's got a great scene uh, and and also Julie Andrews. Julie Andrews, who we is just in saw. It. I mean, she's incredible. It's, so yeah, it's got a it's got an amazing cast. Yeah. It, it's okay. It's 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 cute if you got kids. Take okay. your kids to see it but you if know. not skip it yeah well I, i'm gonna say rent it for okay. me for it's a rented but you know the, if you the have kids the kids like take the kids yeah all right so next is extraordinary measures yes. um a father does everything he can to help his two sec children uh including turning to a doctor played by harrison ford Will we need the tissues for this one? Because from what it looks like, it's going to be a sad one. Well, yeah, it's based on a true story, or oh. and and so these, it's it's one of those tearjerker. It's, it's it pulls on the heartstrings. Yeah. Um, and if again, like the Tooth Fairy, if you like this sort of movie, this is the one you're going to see. It reminds me a little bit of My Sister's Keeper, only not as morose as, as that movie was. Uh, but but it is uplifting and it, and it does have a a story behind it. But it's only about as exciting as you can make uh, lab work. <laughs> in the scientific lab, <laughs> and Harrison Ford's real gruff. I mean, you could have Clint Eastwood, Clint Eastwood could play it too as me. You know? Yeah, but you know, Brendan Fraser uh, is in it. He, yeah, he's the dad, right? He plays the father. He's the father. He's usually in kind of like goofy roles. Yeah, Does he know, do drama well. He can do drama. It's not his best drama. I mean, I've seen movies like there, there's movies like Gods and Monsters and The Quiet American where he's right. he's really kind of brought it to the dr dramatic role. He's I don't know, he sometimes gets a little rocky. The, the acting's not great. It's kind of like a big TV movie on the big screen. Okay, so, got it. All right, so movie. what do you do about this one? Do you see it, rent it, skip it? Oh, rent it is kind of the level. But again, if you really love this kind of stuff, right. you want to check it out. All right, so next and last is uh, right three, just three. Yes, just three. Legion, yes. the action movie about angels coming to Earth, but it's not necessarily a good thing. There are a couple of storylines here going on. Is it easy to follow? Yeah, it's pretty straightforward. I mean, it's it's God is... Uh, lost faith in humanity, so he sends the angels to sort of lay waste, and and our, the archangel Michael is going to help save uh, some people at an out of the way diner. If you're going to have the apocalypse, out of the way diner is way way to have it. Uh, you know, it's the story's not that good, the characters aren't that good, but there are some really cool action scenes. Are there any big names in this? I'm well, it's got Dennis I... Quaid. Okay. That's Paul Bettany there. He plays okay. uh, Michael, and uh, he, he does a great job. And so it's 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 fun. If you like this sort of movie, okay. you've heard me say this before. Yes. <laughs> rent it, see it, skip it. If you like this kind of movie, see it. If not, rent yeah. it. It's a rent it. Okay. Three rent it's today, man. It's January. Somebody broke up on the wrong side of the bed today. All right, Kevin Sorry. Carr, just kidding. We'll see you next time. Thanks so much. Thank you.